G'day ladies and gentlemen, this is a Space Pirates and Zombies 2 playthrough, and I am your host, Vastima. Last time around, we killed some more zombie motherships, but primarily we were just killing time, waiting for the zombie alpha to return to his capital and eventually make his way to one of the far parts of his little empire. Basically, once he heads off that way, we're going to shadow him and then we're going to assassinate him. And once we've committed Alpha Side and he has to make the long trek back to the capital, then, and hopefully it will be from down here, then we are going to destroy all these zombie star bases and we are going to replace them all with our own. For the moment, however, we have to wait for him to build his starbase at Levity, and then we will see where he is going to head off to. Now, we want to go and, in the meantime, we want to hopefully go and defeat and cure Mr. Hookup and also Granny Ruiner. But before we do that, we want to cure two of these. I think Captain Pissed Off and... Yeah, we'll do Fixie, because we know Fixie went into that battle damaged. Um, holy shit. Cure Infection, 4,550. You know, there needs to be a cap, I think, on cure cost, because there just isn't... <laughs> you don't get that much res without working for it, basically. Then again, I don't think Minmax ever anticipated people playing this far into the game, attaining levels this high. I'm not not sure, but yeah, um, yeah, curing. Wait, that's not who I want to cure. Where is Fixie? There we go, and we will cure Fixie as well. Uh, yeah. So now. If I wanted to cure both Granny Ruiner and Mr. Hookup, I wouldn't actually have any, well, wouldn't have much res left for fuel. So, let's hope, let us hope that when we destroy Mr. Hookup and Granny Ruiner, as we have to in order to cure them, that we, oh, that's right, I'm a little bit damaged, that we will get enough res to use as fuel. If not, nothing to panic about because... In our personal stash, I have got 2,000 res put away for just that purpose. And I was supposed to compare some of these cores I've been um, building up with the parts I've got right now. But to be honest, the parts I've got right now are doing fine. So rather than slow down the proceedings, I think we will leave it to later. But you know what we will do? We'll start the fucking timer so that this episode does not end up going for 50 minutes. Okay, timer started. Now, has Levity been constructed yet? No, it has not. So we'll do a quick save. And we... Oh, actually, I just realized, look at all those bloody goons we're carrying around. Holy fucking moly. Okay, so we need to stash a heap of goons as well. Just transfer some across, so uh, I was off with my mathematics. Let, uh, fucking, yeah, that'll do. Actually, that's perfect. Excellent. Okay, all good, all good, all good, all the time. Now, now we will do our quick save. We will look for Mr. Hookup, and then we will defeat him and cure him. And Mr. Hooker, there we are. Okay, move to, move to, holy shit, he's right underneath me. <laughs> that makes things a lot easier. Okay, so, um, Mr. Hooker, let's fight. Oh, I saw one guy come to help out, so it may just be a 1v2 battle. And, yep, 1v2. Ah, oh, oh, that's all right. That's all right. That's all right. Come on, turn around and also get that. Come on. There we go. There we go. Excellent. It's one asteroid down. 
And we will keep spinning around. Yeah, I thought it'd be too much to hope that um, that exploding asteroid would damage that strike craft, but it doesn't matter. Okay, so let's keep spinning around and we will see if... Holy shit. This guy... Oh shit, no, no, actually. If you guys can do some damage to that guy, that would be awesome. Uh-oh, that's not good. Wow, this guy is just... God, he's keeping after us. And wow, we got away. That's awesome. Come on, stay away from him. Stay away from him. Come on. There we go. There we go. Come on. Kill him, kill him, kill him. And, oh, come on. Excellent, 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 excellent. Okay, let us go after these asteroids then. I don't think that my uh, strike craft did any damage to that mothership whatsoever. Whatsoever. Okay, my um, plasma discharger should get it. Should go straight through him. And... Excellent, that one's gone as well. Okay, so apparently I've got two strike craft on the board. You guys go over there. Seriously, just fuck off over there. Okay, now... Okay. Let's go off towards my strike craft then. And run into that rock on the way. I have no idea where that uh, guy with the double chainsaw beams went, unfortunately. Because I would really, really like to... There he is. Uh, there we go. Ooh, did we get him a good one? I think we got him a good one. And again, and again, and excellent. Come on. One more salvo, one more salvo, and he's done for. Excellent. Okay. Where are my guys? There's one over there, and I have no idea where the other guy is. Oh, there he is. He's there too. Fantastic. Fantastic. Okay, you guys go over here. I'll recharge my capacitors, and let's see if we can smash this guy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, excellent, excellent, excellent. Come straight up my wake. Yes. Yes. Excellent. And he's going to lose his nose there. Yes, he did. Excellent. Okay, that really messed him up then. Okay, got to watch all this ordnance coming in. Um, okay, so we got regular torpedoes. As long as I don't get... Um, um, God, my mind went blank. As long as I don't get warheads coming in while I'm concentrating on manual firing, I should be right. Okay, excellent. Fantastic. So we got some cloud torpedoes coming in, but um, now I can concentrate on everything all at once, so it's all good. Let's move my strike craft over thereabouts. And... Excellent. Now, let's slide along over to my strike craft, actually, while my shields regenerate a bit. And... what do we got going on here? Okay. I think we're pretty good now. Considering he can only, um, once, obviously, after we destroy the strike craft from the other ships or the asteroids, whatever's still on the board. He'll only be able to have a maximum of four strike craft in the battle at once, so that will be good. Okay. And now I'm out of capacitor. Of course I'm out of capacitor. Yeah, you guys move over there. Or oh, better still, go pick on that guy. There we go. Whilst I go straight through this corrosive cloud and let's knock down this guy's shields. Ooh, damn, that was close. 
What the fuck? Okay, you just die. Just die. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, and you're gone as well. Fantastic. This should be the last of the strike craft, I believe. No use wasting money. Uh, ooh, especially when he's got a sniper cannon because he will just mince that guy. Did he get away? Yeah, he got away. Excellent. Okay, so... One-on-one -on -one duel. Mano y mano. And... Can we knock down his shields? Yes, excellent. Let's just... With our last few shots, no, we didn't take it off, damn. Plasma Discharger? No, it didn't. It did. It took it off. Awesome. Awesome. Now, let's shoot straight down. Ah, oh, fantastic. I was about to say, let's just shoot straight down his long axis, and uh, we'll be able to blow all these cores up. And we did. There we go. Let's swatch him. Boom. Excellent. And the best thing of all, we also get to quickly pick up these blueprints. It's been a while since we've seen two of our strike craft come through a battle, but then again, I did baby them a bit, to be honest. So let's take all that stuff. And of course, are we going up levels? Of course we're going up levels. Always go up levels. Put some health up. We will put up a shield or reactor. We'll put up the shield... And we'll put up the reactor. So, now we will move everything out of the inventory. There is nothing there that we want to keep. So we'll transfer it all across. Chip it for uh, resources, primarily res, which is exactly what we need, considering Mr. Hookup is now going to be cured. And that will pretty much leave us enough to cure Granny Ruiner and then have 2,000 fuel. Let's just see. Uh, 280 res. Yeah. I don't really think it is worth going over there at this particular juncture. Now, Zombie Alpha is... Why can I not see the symbol for building? Oh, he's definitely building though. Okay. So, let's... Um, actually, we might as well head towards Granny Ruiner. Because we... What the hell am I thinking? There we go. Granny Ruiner. Okay, wait a sec. Where is she? Okay, she's down there past levity. Okay, that works out well. And I said okay a hell of a lot of times then. It's all good though. Let's go on down here. And we should see the base at levity pop up any moment now. Any moment now. There we go. And it looks like... Huh. Well, it looks like Granny Ruin is attacking a pirate, but it looks like the zombie alpha is indeed heading down this way. So as long as I don't do anything stupid again and take out a zombie starbase, I will be able to uh, defeat him when he gets down here to Stork's Landing, and then it will take him quite a while to move back to the capital. But first, before we do that, we want to... See what's going on here, and uh, we've got, uh, actually, we're not going to be able to get involved in this because it's already three zombies versus a bandit. Yep, battlefield is full. So, what can I do in the meantime? Uh-huh. No, no. There's a scrap pile, but... Hmm... Damn, that's a shame. It's a real shame. Um, actually, is there a pirate base around we can attack? Yes, there is. What's this guy? This guy's got 15,000. Excellent. So what I'll do is while they're fighting them, I'll come over here and I will take out this pirate hive. I won't make you watch that since you've seen me do it enough times before. I'll take out the pirate hive and then I'll chase down Granny Ruiner. Okay, uh, so much for that. As I was attacking the pirate base, Mr. Interface, a zombie mothership uh, captain, decided to come down and attack me. Fuck knows why, when he's threat 143, I'm threat 173. I assume he wanted to attack the pirate base. Well, no such luck. And it looks like nobody is coming to help him out. He's fucked. With a capital F. Seriously. Okay, let's just 
not get shot to pieces by the guys with the range beams, or guy with the range beams. And there we go, this guy's going to just charge right up my stern, up my wake, that's awesome. Because... Excellent, now we're far enough away from that guy that my guns will retarget here, awesome. Let's get away from his range beam, we only need to get to, there we go. Come on, come on, a little bit further, there we go, excellent. And there goes his shields! Oh, awesome. And uh, now his ship is falling apart already. Oh, come on, take off that wing, take off that wing. Just before we run out of capacitor, bits are falling off him everywhere. <laughs> and all my uh, zapper drones from my strike craft are accelerating his destruction. Look at all their lasers go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, and he's gone. So all we need to do now is destroy any remaining strike craft on the board and this battle will be over almost as quickly as it started. Farewell. Let's darden. Area clear. Back to the star map we go. Awesome. So let's um, quickly take all this stuff. Are we going to go up levels? Yes we are. We're going to go up levels. So I will take some uh, shield strength actually and we will just Quickly transfer this across, see what we could get for it, uh, just a pittance. And once again, I'm going to try and attack this bandit hive. I don't really need to now, I guess. I've um, used up enough time, I can go after Granny Ruiner. But I will still try and attack this bandit hive and, um, and loot it, because I need all the scrap I can get anyway. And like I said, I won't... M oh, are you kidding me? You really don't want me taking out this... Okay, well, I will be fighting a bunch of zombies instead once again. I'm glad I didn't stop the timer yet. Okay, how many got involved? That is the big question. Two. Two, two, two. Not too much of a problem. Okay, let's go right and then go straight ahead. And then we'll turn left just a little bit. And see if we can... Uh, they're just regular lasers, that shouldn't be a massive problem. Uh, it's the only problem, it doesn't tell me the distance to the asteroids. I don't know when I am in plasma um, discharge range. Well, I will when it fires. Now... Let's get away from the fail gate. We don't want to set that thing off. Come on. Come on. Come on. Is that a hit? Yes, that's a hit. Okay, excellent. Well, we were definitely within range that time. Let's go on past and hopefully... Ah, son of a bitch. Poor timing. Good thing is... I should still be in range. Yep, there we go. Excellent. Now, let's fucking kill this guy, because he is really pissing me off. And... Nope, still didn't do it. And now you are out of range. That's alright, that's alright, that's alright. Was it only the two infected asteroids? I think it was only two. Okay. Oh, excellent. I think the mothership might... Might just pull ahead of the strike craft. That would be awesome. If I can um, get a quick victory over one of these motherships. That will definitely cut down. Uh, did that guy have a range beam? Nope, just regular laser. I could have swore one of these did. Nope. Oh, I think it was just... Um... Oh, shit. Those shitty little fucking lasers did in my shields. What the fuck? There we go. Take him out. Holy shit, he was resilient, wasn't he? Okay, any of my, um, any parts on my ship about to fall off? No, it looks good, looks good. My shield's back up. And, um, I should probably be more careful around shitty lasers. <laughs> it's not just the range beams and the chainsaw beams. The shitty lasers will do me in as well. What was I saying before I was so rudely interrupted? Yes, it wasn't a range beam. I saw it was just a, um, a zapper drone. 
Oh, kill Mr. Shitty Laser number two. There we go. All good. Ah, oh, not all good. Come on. There we go. Ooh, we got some solid hits with the Plasma Discharger. And... There we go. Excellent. Now... Uh, we've got a um, full-size guy. Full-size guy? That's not what I meant. A medium or a large. That's what I meant to say. Iron shotgun. Uh, he's nothing special. Okay, so... Looks like I've destroyed all of the um, asteroid strike craft, which is awesome. So the most they can have on the board is eight. And there's nowhere near that. So I'm depleting his hangers, which is awesome. Very awesome. What's not awesome is one of these guys has a mass driver. Oh, actually, it's that mothership over there. So let's not lose our shields again. That would suck. Capacitors regenerating and... And... Come on, kill the other guy as well. Yep. Excellent. Fantastic. So, kind of been saying excellent a lot today, haven't I? It's not usually one of the words that pours out of my mouth, but you know, it's usually okay. That must get so annoying. Holy fuck, that's a lot of pulsar action going on. Jesus Christ. It's almost, actually, this is the guy with the mass driver. This is just the guy with a fuck ton of pulses. It's usually my move, at least earlier in the game. I love me some pulses. Okay, and that guy's gone. Fantastic, but I really would like to knock out the guy with the mass driver just to be on the safe side, just in case I fuck up. Not that that would ever happen, because, you know, you, you all know I'm perfect and never make a mistake. Oh no, that's not me, that's other people. I fuck up all the time. Okay, so, um, this guy does not want to be brought into combat range. But here we go. Don't always get what you want. But sometimes, if I try real hard, I get what I need. Now, let's spin it around. Ooh. And, ah, oh, excellent. I did it again. What the fuck is up with the excellence? Excellent, excellent, excellent. Yeah, that, that, well, it doesn't really qualify as singing. It qualifies as making vocal noise, but making vocal noise other than talking is disallowed on this channel. No humming, no singing, no making noises that sound like a goat being strangled. And fuck, I'm just raving on with some crap today. My god. Okay. What are you doing, Mr. Laser Bunny? Come on, I want to kill this guy. I want to kill him. I want to kill him. Let me kill him. Did I get him? Did I get him? Plasma discharges? No. I didn't. Well, it was worth hope and a prayer. Holy shit, those iron bombers are really fucking me up. Okay, let's yeah, let's run straight into that spore ball and that regular warhead. Yeah, that that was just great. We are not getting to that guy. <laughs> Nobody wants us to get anywhere near that guy. Okay. Ah, oh, that guy has a mass driver. Uh, oh, okay, now I'm confused. No, it is... Mm. Or is it you? It's you. It's fucking you. Here, Mr. Confusing. Come on. Fucking die. Come on. There we go. Have a face full of Defender drones at close range. That is what you get. Engaging a mothership at close range with a strike craft. Now... You, you little shit, who just don't want to die and who have actually repaired a little bit. 
I'm coming after you, and I'm gonna kill you, and I'm gonna run straight into a whole bunch of shit without juice in the capacitor, which man, I could do no power to shields, which is really bad, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sure you can guess that, but for some reason, I thought it needed me to whisper for, because I'm fucking insane. Now, let's spin around this guy, and unload some sniper fire onto him. If we can get back into range, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, turn, 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 you fucking cow, not into the toxic cloud, there we go, not into the range beam either, there we go, all good, let's just stop the pulses as they get towards us, and we're nearly out of capacity juice, so let's Quickly run away. Quickly run away. There we go. All good. All good. No, 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 no. Stay out of range beam range. And... Wow, that's a bit of a scary look. All those pulses coming towards me. But there aren't a lot of pulses coming towards me. Because little bits are falling off him. Including, obviously, his pulse cannons. Do you see any pulse cannons firing at me? I don't see any pulse cannons firing at me. Oh, that battle went on a little bit longer than expected. And you know what? Didn't really give me all that fucking much either. Hans, Booby, I wasn't your white knight. Ah, oh, well. Jesus Christ, Hans, I saved you so many times. Oh, God. Okay, nothing I can do about it. Let's just um, put this into weapon damage for the moment. Put this into health. Put this into armor. Hans, nothing I can do right now. I will eventually um, fix you. But right now that base, yeah, that's a dangerous base to have. Um, guess I could give it to Cracker. Yeah, stuff it, I'll give it a cracker. Um, now, how much shit is in the scavenge pile? Yeah, I'm going to have to pick up that scavenge pile. I will have to take the risk, but I will ignore the pirate base. There we go. And then we will go to the inventory and we will actually... No, no speed on that. Oh, a little bit of speed on that. They may just be a week apart. I don't know. Uh, but all of the, holy shit, plus nine speed, but I don't want a chainsaw beam, large Sun Hunter engine. So instead we do that, we do this, we do that, excellent. And now we want to do two things. We want to see where the fuck Granny Ruiner is, getting into another battle against bandits yet again. Okay, wait, what? right near me again what what are the chances of that that is awesome okay zombie alpha though zombie alpha is holy shit already all the way at stalks landing fuck granny ruiner can wait granny ruiner can wait please please tell me you are going yes you are you're going up to milk tear i don't know milk tear or milk tear i assume it's milk tear otherwise it would probably be milky tear maybe yeah yes okay now so the zombie alpha and i wonder if anybody is anywhere within range to help this guy i don't think so I don't think so at all. So, the zombie alpha, you are going down. Okay. <laughs> mano y mano. Oh, that's a night like this, dude. Okay. Yes, looks like both of those guys have got range beams, but. Oh, shit. Oh shit, that all went wrong. I got stuck up 
stuck on so many rocks it's all good though his shields are almost down and if we can just take I uh, did want to take out his engine but this will work oh maybe we can maybe we can or maybe we could just run into a rock did that take his engine off no but this one did excellent <gasps> oh shit I didn't realize those range beams were doing quite that much damage fuck Fuck, I'm getting hit by both. There we go. Turn around that way. No use getting hit by... Getting hitten? Yeah, no use getting hitten. No use getting hit by both at once. And what the fuck are you guys doing? Go over there. Destroy him. I can... T Actually, holy shit. They are destroying the fuck out of the zombie alpha. Whoa. Awesome. Excellent. You're done. You are done and done for. Yeah, destroy that guy and then we'll destroy this guy. Awesome. And best of all, he did not drop a blueprint. Actually, why am I saying, oh, best of all, he didn't drop a blueprint. But seriously, it means I don't have to go chasing a fucking blueprint. And Alpha Side has been completed yet again. And this time... He is a long... Oh. Yep, I know. I've got to put this shit up again. I know. Uh-huh. And excellent. Two levels from one zombie alpha. So I have completed my premeditated alpha side down here at uh, Milk Tear. And he will have to slowly go all the way back to the capital, which should give me enough time to... I'm just trying to decide. Well, this one I will definitely build a base at. Um, how much time have we got? I probably will not have enough time to take out another star base. Then again, maybe I will. If it doesn't get reinforced, of course it is likely to get reinforced. So I pr probably will not have that chance. But right now, what we want to do is we want to look at the scavenge pile. It is tiny. Fuck it. Let's move here and we will build a <clears throat> Sun Hunter style base. And looks like no zombies are coming to stop me. That is a negative. Awesome. Fixie. Fantastic. I will indeed accept you to service. So, Milk Tear has been added to our little clockwork alarm faction empire i have been calling it the clockwork empire so i may as well call it the clockwork empire once again um of course we are under time at the moment so what do i want to do there was a zombie somewhere around here but uh here we go threat 156 simon against a tiny r star base so if i take this and only simon gets involved it will actually be Simon who is the bigger threat. So what I might do is I might I might come down here to Stork's Landing. And, oh, and Captain Pissed Off wants to join me as well. That is awesome. Hopefully uh, Mr. Hookup will also join that easily without me having to... Um, I just realised I forgot to fucking repair my ship, didn't I? Son of a bitch. And drop off that part. So transfer that. Chip that for res. So much for having all this time. You know. Everything's going to work out well. Yeah it's not going to work out well if I fucking waste time is it. Okay. Let's try that again. We'll go down here. And. And. Presuming that there aren't a whole buttload of zombies anywhere around here. Let's. Have a try at taking out this base now, right at the end of the episode. Oh yeah, nobody made it in time. That is awesome, fantastic. Let's just go in, destroy the asteroids. Oh, actually, here's an asteroid here. Destroy the asteroids and destroy the starbase, which will be tiny. 
Okay, so it's got double ion warheads. But they look pretty weak. And let's spin around. Oh, look how quick his shield's are going down. And we're not even going to need to destroy that other asteroid, I don't think. He's going to be dead in seconds. And so there we go. And he's done for. All we got to do now is quickly knock out these strike craft. One last one to go. Come on. You can die. You have my permission. And there we go. Area clear. Back to the star map we go. And there we have it. The zombie alpha has been left to crawl all the way back from Milk Tear to its capital. Uh, I have established my first new territory in quite a while. And of course, as I said, the plan is to completely dominate this little tiny area here by building star bases all over it. And then once that is done, we can um, consider what we're going to do next to end this zombie menace to the galaxy. And that's it for this episode. Give me your thoughts down below and like and subscribe as you will. Until next time, take care of yourselves and most importantly, have a good one!